Hello everyone. Today I am telling how to write borrowing subtraction. So, the borrowing and the normal subtraction it's not same. So, it's different. So, we are learning about borrowing subtraction. So, look at this. As you can see here, you have to cross these two numbers and write here 12. In one place, you need to write 12 here. And in 10th place, it's 7, so you need to write the before number. 7, seven before number is 6, so you should write 6. Then, you, you should count from 3. You should close all the fingers and count from 3. 3 after 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. How many fingers do you open? Nine. So the answer is nine. The answer is nine. The tenth place is the normal subtraction. So the normal subtraction, how to write normal subtraction. You should not you should not subtract from this number. You should subtract from this number. So, how to do normal subtraction? Take six fingers, close three fingers. One, two, three. So, we left three fingers. So, the answer is three. All to mix, 39. This is also the same. Okay. Write 11 here. One thing is the important thing. I will say it now. What number is here? You should write 11. Look, suppose is this boring subtraction. You should cross these two. You, to the before num you have to write the before number here uh, you should cross this and write 12 here upset 2 you should write 12 and the same but you should write the before number okay 11 and the 4 before is 3 so you should count from two. Close all fingers and two after three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. The answer is nine. Should you should count until eleven. But this is the normal one. Take three fingers, close two fingers. One, two. The answer is one. So, all makes 19. This is also the same. You should take... Okay, sorry, I... Okay, sorry. Okay, sorry, I'm telling wrong. So... First thing we, sorry I tell wrong, first thing we need to check these numbers and see it is subtraction or borrowing subtraction. You should ch check these two, I mean not this one, you should check this, this row, one's place, you need to check one's place and check it and do. Do the borrowing subtraction. Okay. Let's get into the video. Okay. Here I have to write. 
12. The 10 count is 12 for 2. So you should write 12. And the before number of 8 is 7. So you should write 7. Okay. Take 6 fingers. I mean close all fingers. And count from 6. 6 after 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and 12. So the answer is 6. This is the normal subtraction. I already tell in this and this. Okay? And take seven fingers, close seven fingers. So the answer is zero. And all to mix six. Because this this zero doesn't count. Because this zero don't have anything. And it's the same for these two. Wait a second. So let's let's go to the next problem. Cross these two, and here have to write twelve. Do you remember that? For you need to check these two. Okay, the sound before the six. Okay. You should count from seven. Do you remember all what I say? Okay. Seven after eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. I mean, no. Let's count again. Seven after eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah. So the answer is five. Okay. And take six fingers. Close six fingers. It's zero. I say this too. The zero doesn't count. You check these. I'm checking now these numbers. Okay. Take one finger. Close one finger. I'm going to take one finger, close eight fingers. That's not possible. So, this is boring. Eleven. And. What's that boss? Okay. So, you should write the before number for eight. Before number for eight is is seven so you should count from eight and close all fingers eight after nine ten eleven so the answer is three right three okay then you should write you should write this only normal subtraction. You should not see this and you should only see this. So if you want you can ask your mommy or daddy or sister or brother to keep like this. Okay? It's so funny. Okay then two of I mean Take seven fingers, close two fingers. One, two. The answer is one, two. If you don't, don't. If you don't know how to count, you can count like this. If it's more than this, you should count like this, like this. One, two, three, like that. You should count like that. So I can count like this. So the answer is five. First we need to, first I will, I will count like this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, it's correct, so 53, this is not possible, I check it, 
like that. So the answer is five. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I write six. Okay. Five. It's five. Yes? Okay. Just the normal subtraction. I thought you remembered this. Take three fingers. Close one finger. Answer is two. The answer is twenty-three. We had left seven. We had left seven. We will do that now. <coughs> if you don't know, just count like this: one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Okay? <coughs> Take two fingers. Okay. I mean, sorry. I should borrow these two. Twelve. And <coughs> five to four. Four. If you don't know, just, just count this too, okay? Like, if you don't know, what is the before of five, six, okay? You should count one, two, three, four, like that. Then the next number two, you have to count five. So you know what to write, the before number. Take seven fingers. Seven after eight, I mean seven after eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. The answer is five. So you okay? Then this take four fingers, close three fingers. The answer is one. The answer is fifteen. So one thing. If we had zero and three, you should write. I will tell you, I will explain. Uh, if we had zero and three, you should not borrow. You can borrow, then, but 